Hey there everyone, today I'm going to be cooking some gorgeously creamy and delicious vegan roast pumpkin soup. And I got the idea from a friend who served me pumpkin soup at her house and I've been spending a few weeks trying to replicate and master the recipe to suit my family. So for this recipe you will need one large butternut pumpkin, one brown or red onion, approximately four medium to large potatoes, three carrots, some vegetable stock or vegetable broth that is vegan friendly, two teaspoons approximately of paprika or cayenne, one to two teaspoons of sage, I prefer one teaspoon, three to four teaspoons of thyme, I prefer four, some ground black pepper for taste, some olive oil for roasting and frying and two tablespoons of vegan butter. So to begin I need to prepare the pumpkin. So I chop this and I take out all the seeds which I end up putting in my compost but you can also use them for roasting and then I just peel the skin off the pumpkin, chop it into larger chunks and make sure that they're chunks that would be nice and soft within 40 minutes of roasting. Once the pumpkin is all cut up, I then drizzle a little bit of olive oil onto the oven tray and coat them very, very lightly and make sure it's very light. I then pop them into the oven for 35 to 40 minutes at approximately 180 degrees Celsius. I'm not sure what that is in Fahrenheit. I then peel and cut the carrots and potatoes into large chunks and I pop them in the oven as well. Just before I pop them in the oven, I drizzle a little bit of olive oil on them and then also put a bit of thyme leaves on top. This just infuses a bit more of that beautiful flavor within these vegetables. When the veggies have finished roasting, I then take them out of the oven and leave them to cool for a bit. While they're cooling, I then cut up the onion and start to shallow fry that in my large soup making pot. While the onion is on its way to being caramelized, I then add the sage, paprika and the rest of the thyme leaves in just to fry with the onion. I then melt in the vegan butter before adding the vegetable broth. I allow this to boil for about 5 to 10 minutes to allow all the flavors to mix together before I start adding the vegetables into the pot.
I then transfer in the roasted pumpkin and also most of the roasted potato and carrot. I leave about one to two cups aside because we do like chunks within our soup. To allow all the flavors to mix in together before I blend this all up, I allow this to boil for about 20 minutes, stirring every three to five minutes. So next it's just a matter of blending and I highly recommend you use a stick blender if you have the option, but you can use a regular blender like I am. This is very, very time consuming as it took about four lots within the blender and it is a bit more messy than I would have liked, but I just don't see a need to go buy a stick blender when I can use other methods to achieve the same kind of thing. And now that it's all blended up, I then put it back into the soup pot and add in my chunks, stir it through and it is ready to serve. So to serve, I always have just a tiny bit of pepper on top and just some fresh bread on the side. Sometimes I like to cook my own bread, but I already had some in the cupboard, so I just opted for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe video, and if you want more vegan recipes, then let me know. I have got another one in the works, and I hope you guys will like that. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, because I'd love to be here for every single video. Like this video if you like the recipe, comment down below if there's something you'd like to see on this channel, and I hope you all have a fantabulous day.